Hi guys, just a short video. Uh, Bitcoin broke 12k and um, fear and greed index is at uh, 95. Um, I, I think it's ridiculous if you're invested in Bitcoin BTC um, for 50% of your portfolio. I, I don't think that's wise at all at current valuations. Of course, I'm always recommending people to sell Bitcoin, uh, to not buy Bitcoin. Um, that I've been doing that for two, three years. Uh, but uh, very often I have recommended people to invest big in crypto. Um, but, um, but, uh, but, 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 um, but uh, it's strange. Most of my followers, when they share their for portfolio, they still have like by far their largest position within crypto is Bitcoin BTC. I, I, I think, like, I've always recommend to sell because of poor fundamentals. This coin is, is, is in adoption, not doing well compared to the competition such as Ethereum and Bitcoin Cash. Um, but um, just simply because of the trans rising transaction fees. But um, uh, what's just so surprising in the crypto world is people don't care about that. Huh? Like. Uh, all this analysis, all these YouTube videos are about uh, Bitcoin is going up in price and, and let's do some analysis of the price. But like this should be like something that you do 10% of the time and 90% of the time you're looking at, um, at, at, at is it growing and adoption or st do people start using this or not? Huh? Like that's really what's going to drive the price in the end. Yeah? Uh, and you can just see that in your environment. Uh, do people start using it? And if you're only interested in a financial bubble, well then at least you should see people start investing in it. Huh? Uh, this is not happening. Currently, even though Bitcoin went from 3k to 12k now, uh, the broad market is not uh, starting to invest in Bitcoin. So it's just like people that are already in the market having FOMO and buying in, um, thinking that the bull market will start again. Uh, and not caring at all about uh, adoption numbers. Um, yeah, just very, very bad, uh, very bad. Eh? And as an investor, you act like that, you deserve to lose your money. Um, uh, investing is about allocating capital, uh, uh, allocating capital, uh, rewarding projects that uh, that uh, have done well um, and uh, are uh, should be valued higher. Uh, so you always start with. What's its value in the market, the project, the company or coin, um, and, uh, and, and what is it offering in the market? How many needs does the people's needs does it satisfy? And um, yeah, um, this is not happening in crypto. Um, so uh, I think, yes, um, I also have Bitcoin Cash. I think it's also overvalued uh, seriously. Uh, and um, Mm, mm, mm. But uh, of course, I uh, sold already a piece. I'm planning to sell another piece uh, if uh, alts also pump versus Bitcoin. That hasn't happened yet. Um, actually, it happened in the first uh, move up when Bitcoin went from 3 to 4k in one day, or was it from 4 to 5k in one day in the 1st of April? Then also, alts uh, did a good pump versus B2, BTC, even uh, Bitcoin Cash also went from a low from 0 0.03 to 0 0.06 times 2 versus Bitcoin while Bitcoin also went up so but then usually it takes a while alts go back down Bitcoin cash go back down versus uh, BTC and, and, and Bitcoin cash has gone down from 0 0.06 to 0 0.04 again so 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 I'm waiting uh, for alts to pump usually that happens after uh, Bitcoin has pumped uh, then Bitcoin corrects a little uh, or goes sideways and then uh, alts pump also to new highs um, but this could bring Bitcoin cash back to the 0 0.06 but I, I think considering I'm believing we're still in a bear market actually usually it disappoints a little also and so they, 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 they don't make new highs versus Bitcoin but they do of course have a pump um, um, and, uh, and and so I think if Bitcoin cash pumps from 0 0.04 to 0 0.05 um, that it would be a good time for me to sell another piece and probably that will bring it to about 600, 700 US dollars. And I think that's important. You always have to look at uh, risk reward valuation and, and even though 
Um, like I'm 50-50 now. I'm a 50% Bitcoin Cash, 50% Tesla, but leveraged uh, 2x. I would say like short term, yes. Um, uh, Tesla leverage 2x is a much better investment than Bitcoin Cash short term, but long term not. Actually, Bitcoin Cash is a better investment, and then talking of five years, than uh, than Tesla. But so like, I would say 25. Uh, percent only Bitcoin Cash today, but 75% Tesla in the short term, but in the long term is the inverse, so 50-50 is fine. So, so I think I, I'm pretty good in my allocations, but what should you, um, what, what should you value the highest? The short term uh, expectations or the long term expectations? That's a difficult question. I don't have the answer to that, uh, but if I should value short term expectations, uh, that sh should actually lower my mm, Bitcoin Cash exposure already. Um, so, so, so I have to think about that. But um, in any case, um, the whole crypto market, I think, is uh, is uh, at high risk to correct strongly. There is has been no exception in history. Every time the NVTS um, indicator was uh, high, I will post the link below. Um, then. Uh, and that happened 12 times since inception. Um, it always corrected at least 30% uh, and sometimes even 80%. And actually, um, uh, we're very high at risk to have that 80% correction. Um, so, yeah, that's the situation. Uh, I think it's uh, still justified to, to, to hope for an alt and a lost alt pump here uh, but uh, but certainly not something to buy into and, and to risk money on but if you still have coins you might want to time that a little um, uh, to sell bitcoin already today at 12k um, for fiat and maybe a piece for alts and then um, sell the alts also if it would pump i think that's the best advice i can give um, and, and and look um, outward huh? um, like for example in tesla look at the youtube videos the bull case is about adoption, evidence, hard evidence of adoption. That's what you want to see. Huh? It's about uh, growth in revenue and in uh, gross margins and gross profits. That's the story you want to see. Um, and that can also be there for cryptos. But then it's about NVTS, the network uh, value, like the amount of transactions compared to the value of the network. That's fundamental analysis. Eh? And that's been a flashing red. It's a red indicator is valued way too high. The Bitcoin and probably all other coins too, compared to the amount of transactions on the network. Ethereum is maybe an exception, but probably also not. Uh, also relatively valued high. Uh, uh, compared to the amount of transactions on the network and, and and that's fundamental analysis and totally missing and all these uh technical analysts and and, and super super important um and it's uh, it's flashing red and uh and, and 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 12 times in 12 in the past this has led to very very strong uh, corrections and then we're not even talking about uh that actually also very high we're not even out of the bull market eh? No, no, no. This is even in uh, uh, like during bull markets and VTS flashes high. You have a very strong correction. Uh, it takes um, at least some months to pan out. And, um, and, 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 and um, yeah, I mean, at least 30 percent. But um, yeah, there is also a very strong two case to be made that we're actually not even out of the bear markets. And, uh, and, and, and we get an 80 percent correction to new lows. So check my uh, pinned tweet for that. I think uh, crypto is uh, uh, right now very, 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 very high risk. Huh? Um, yes, it of course still has a very high potential reward also. Eh? But since it's very high risk, um, it's not a good risk reward ratio. A very high risk, very high potential reward is just an average risk reward ratio. And uh, if you look at my last trollo videos, or um, the video where I say potential um, upwards potential for crypto is indeed fantastic. Only in five years it is expected to hit uh, 20 trillion dollars uh, uh, coins like Bitcoin, Bitcoin Cash, Ethereum, a few trillion each. 
uh, this is still the, uh, the, the upwards potential and still likely to hit um, but, um, but, 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 but at the same time it's still likely to correct to below 100 billion uh, over the next half year uh, to uh, possibly a low of 50 billion for the total market we're now at what is it 300 400 billion something like that so a tremendous correction and then still we're in a bull market uh, in, in, that will go extremely high so yeah take that into account guys really right now bye